This is a short demonstration of my Radio Shack Duophone TAD311. Currently it is in stop, remote turn on, and I'm turning it out to announce only. In this mode it will receive calls and play back the outgoing message and hang up instead of record a message. It is in this mode you can choose to listen to your outgoing message you recorded. Uh, when you are in this mode, press start to play back your message. I will switch it over to play by calls to listen to recorded messages. This message was on the machine when I bought it. Hi Emily, this is Sharon. It is June 22nd at 11.25. I cannot get in on any of your lines. I need you to call me. Thank you. To rewind, just move the dial over to the corresponding position. It is quite a fast rewind mechanism. Now we're going to switch it over to answer calls and make it answer incoming calls and record messages. So let's call it. It is in delay mode so it will ring about four times and then answer. I turned down the volume because if you call the machine from the same room with volume on the recorded message will be screwed up. You can't hear this very well, but my message is being played on the phone. Testing, testing, one, two, three, one, two, three. The call light is now on, indicating that I received a message. So let's listen to it. And don't forget to raise the volume. To raise the message, you have to hold down the raise button and turn the dial over to rewind. If you are using a normal audio tape, don't forget to play the tape forward a bit so that you get past the leader, or else it will not record the beginning of the first message you get. As I don't live in the US, here is a photo of my setup that allows me to use a 120 volts 60 hertz appliance. The black box is a converter that turns 240 volts 50 hertz to 12 volts and then the box in front of that is a inverter that turns 12 volts into 120 volts 60 hertz. This is a photo of the insides of the flywheels. Um, these uh, small hockey pucks had got stuck, they wouldn't move, so that was, was uh, hindering my machine from working properly. So I had to take everything apart and fix that, and finally I got it working. Here are some photos of my machine.
with Smith, Wesson, and me. I bet you're dying to hang up and not leave a message. But dying ain't much of a living, boy. So go ahead. Make my day. Emily, this is Sharon. It is June 22nd. I think 1125. I cannot get in. I can hear your line. And you did call me. Thank you. you.